everyone. This is Flippin' Frozen with Ladies Night. I've got Melody and I've got Marion. It's Ladies Night. <laughs> oh, I can't say that too many times, can I? Because oh, make it sing. We don't want you to sing. But, you know, uh, we've got lots of goodies. We've got, uh, from what I hear, we got lots of jewelry and, and crafts and 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 toys and Christmas stuff. Yeah, no, Possibly, oh. no Christmas stuff. I don't know. No, no Christmas. Hey, you know uh, something? We will bring whatever the audience wants us to bring. I think that's, that's the way it is. Yeah, it's, it's, if, if anybody wants anything, they just have to tell us. We just have to get people out there to actually come on the show and say hi. <laughs> well, I, always, I always start my auctions are, are anything that I do live um, with a, a temperature check. And it's 44 degrees going down. Um, <laughs> is it raining or anything? Yeah, Monday, Monday they're calling for snow and snow showers, and Tuesday I think the high is going to be like 35. <laughs> oh, should I tell you what it is right here in down south? We're at 70 degrees right now, 73. Oh, I'm sorry. Push that Early heat. Down 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 down. Down. <laughs> <laughs> I got my heater going just to keep warm. <laughs> Yeah, That's why you always see me short sleeves, shorts on. Yeah. <laughs> I'm all bundled up. <laughs> You're going to have to give me your little hat and your little scarf, your gloves. Right. You'll be freezing, and I'll be with the fan. Woo! We're going up to the 80s on Saturday and Sunday. 80s. Warm again. Wow. No rain in sight. Sunny. Well, I tell you, on on uh, Tuesday, Tuesday and Wednesday, the high was like seventy six, mm -hmm. and it just went downhill from there. Well, that's <laughs> Still, the it's getting good, snowy and icy. Yeah, yeah. And they said um, my, uh, Sunday into Monday, or Monday Monday during the day is supposed to be uh, somewhere in there is supposed to be freezing rain. And we got to say hello. We have Lisa's treasures in. We have Yellow Brick Road reselling in. Somewhere in there, it's supposed to be freezing. Three. We got Tamara and Lisa. Hello, hello, hello. All right. Oh, we got two. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's Lady saying, you know what it is? We put the little feeler out there. They have to get the little notification. Hey, you know something? That's how we build this channel. We build it. You know you're going to come here. You're going to have a good time. You're going to see some interesting, weird stuff that I bring out where Melanie is like, where did you get that? And what is that? <laughs> I still have a challenge to myself. I want to be the one that brings the weirdest item out at every single show. You about just about do that. <laughs> <laughs> no doubt about that. <laughs> it's like if there's anything you want to see or if there's anything you can really think that's weird, Put it in the chat, and I'm going to see if I can find it. <laughs> that's a challenge. That's a personal challenge for myself. I don't know. You don't know? Uh, 43. You're only one degree colder than me. Friday <laughs> <sighs> night. It's Friday the 13th. Hopefully nobody out there has just good dexophobia. No, we could do um, horror movies. <laughs> horror movies. I know. I still. I'm still floating in movies. <laughs> I've, I have too many movies. <laughs> but yes, just good dexophobia. The fear of the number thirteen. Little tidbit on that one. What was that again? Triskaidekaphobia. You have the fear of thirteen. Oh, okay. Well, I also heard that uh, um, Friday the thirteenth is a lucky day for who? For Italian. <laughs> really, for who? <laughs> yeah, right. I've got a little black kitty. My cat's black. Oh, your cat's yeah. black. I'm glad my cat's not black. <laughs> Well, now I have two gray ones because little new kitten is gray. So two gray ones, one black. My little cute kitties. 
I love my cats. Or Fred, Freddy Krueger. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> or Freddy. <laughs> it's always been a good day. Hello, Carla. Welcome to the show. It's always been a good day for you. Oh, wow. You must be Italian. <laughs> Okay, nothing yeah, wrong with that. I mean, the lights, the light today, the lights blinkered off and then they came back on. It's like, oh, is that an omen? <laughs> no, don't say that. Well, it could be if, the, if you said there's a storm or something coming in. No, there was no storm, no nothing. I was like, okay, either somebody went downstairs and flipped the wrong switch. <laughs> <laughs> and we have the real, real housewife in. See, look at that. You're getting a nice little show today. Yeah, all right. I I think we need to get started then. We got started. Nice little crowd okay, coming in. Who wants to go first, Melanie? It doesn't matter. I could go first. I got weird stuff. Okay. <laughs> Today would have been my oh happy birthday to her, call Carla. My condolences. <laughs> oh, wait, am I up? I You're can't. up. Okay, there I am. I'm sorry. We were delaying. We were trying to get. Okay. <laughs> I'm just going to bring out weird stuff. How about that? Um, okay. I have a collection of unicorn stretchy putty. So it's like silly putty, but you could stretch it. And I want to show them to you. They are little tiny bags. And there's five of them in each bag. And it's lovable unicorns. And they come in different colors. There's like a blue, a green. Uh, there's some pink. There's different colors. I am going to give you, you ready for this? You're going to get 14 packages of these. There's five per pack, so you're getting 70 of these. And we're going to do $5 for 70 packs of Silly Putty. How about that? It's great for kids. I'm going to type that in. And we got 70 packs of Silly Putty for kids. And that is going to be $5. So, what it is, is like I said, it's a little unicorn rainbow putty. It has little cute little unicorns on it. They're individually wrapped, which means it's great as um, a sensory thing, a sensation thing. If you have children that are jittery, or even if yourself, if you're anxious or jittery, just play with the stretchy putty all day long. And you're going to get 70 packs of these for $5. If that's not a great deal, it's just ways of saying... Use them as little stocking stuffers. Use them as party favors. You're just getting 70 bucks. How about that? It's actually uh, 14 packages, but each package has five per pack. And you'll get all this stretchy putty with little cute unicorns on it. Little cute I love yous. They're from Toy Smith. They're uh, 0 0.35, 10 grams each. And they're the lovely little unicorns. And of course, if nobody's interested in this, because it is like slimy stuff, this stuff is also great if you have like stains on your walls. You can get the stains off. It's really weird. I don't know how silly buddy is. You get the, the marks and stuff oh, like I didn't that. Know that. Well, that's good to know. <laughs> yeah, because you can like you use it for cleaning. Yeah, you can use it for cleaning and stuff. If you're just bored out of your mind. Like I said, you take the one, you just open it up and just squeeze it in your hand. Get your hand all slimy and stuff like that. Roll it in little balls. Why not? It's a weird item I thought I would introduce, but that's what I'm doing. I can give you a dollar for 10 if nobody bids. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so you only want 10? You said two packs. Huh? Okay, I can give you a dollar. Or you want ten packs. Wait, wait. I'm confused real. <laughs> I can't math. It's a total of 14 packs. There's five in each pack. So you would only want two packs for a dollar? She wants ten packs. Oh, you want ten packs. Okay, so that would be 50 silly putties. Okay, so you want 50 of these for a dollar. Okay, you know something? I could do that. Is there any other bids besides 50 for a dollar? I was confused for a minute. One, two, three, four, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Okay, but then she puts three dollars. 
three dollars. You want all of them for three dollars? How about that? Because you're only missing four packs. <laughs> what a deal. I will give you all of these for three dollars. Does that work? Three dollars for ten. No, well, you're gonna get seventy. <laughs> you're getting seventy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no real housewife, you win. I'm gonna give you all of them. So instead of five dollars, I will take the three dollar bit. How about that? And you will get all of these. <laughs> and I still have your order, so I'll just combine that with the other order. <laughs> Does that work? <laughs> High tech math. <laughs> See, this, this is why it's ladies night. We have some fun. I got to bring it in. To, okay. Sold the real, real housewife. <laughs> for $3. I, I, I will take that. that I book. didn't I need my paper. <laughs> Sold. Sold. Okay. <laughs> okay. The next item up for bed. <laughs> no return. No, I actually, um, Carla, if there's ever any problems, I do accept uh, refunds, returns, changes, store credit, that sort of thing. My products are guaranteed, so I'm I'm good that way. Okay, so <laughs> next item I have, this is, you know how they have like the mermaid tail blankets? This is actually the frozen version of it. So it's a little Olaf tail where it's a complete sealed portion. I think you like stick yourself in the Olaf blanket and you have like an Olaf tail, I guess. <laughs> so we're gonna do Olaf blanket. Starting bid is $6 for the starting bid. And it's for the Olaf Frozen 2, it's called the Blanky Tails, recommended ages six and up. It's super soft, it's brand new, um, fits up to children. Five feet tall. So if they're taller than five foot, it is not recommended because it is the, um, the tail portion. Um, it's machine washable. Uh, I'm just trying to think what else. It's for 54 inches. And I think that's it. So very cute Olaf. It has a cute little uh, leaf pattern. And we have the Real World Housewife in for $6. Do I have anybody for seven? Makes a great Christmas present. Great for the holidays. And it has cute little uh, leaves and Olaf, and it's like fun. So I say $6 going once, going twice. I didn't look at the lag. I don't know how long the lag is. You know something, Real Real Housewife sold to you for $6. I can't even type tonight. <laughs> sold. Thank you so much for that. Okay, one more item. What am I bringing? All right, this is actually, I will say this, it is a used item, but I'm starting really, really cheap on it. Uh, oh, uh, and we're going to start this off at $5. It is Gucci Bamboo. As you can notice, it has been used, but it's 75% full. And yes, I can sell this on eBay. I don't want to sell it on eBay. I really don't. <laughs> Thank you so much. Real Real Housewife is in at five. But yes, this is a Gucci bamboo. The size is uh, 75 milliliters, 2.5 fluid ounces. But like I'm saying, it's approximately 75% full. The smell is absolutely wonderful. There's no box or anything, but this will be wrapped up like anything. It will go ground. It is a amazing smelling perfume. If anybody is interested, we've got a bit in for five. If not, Angie is going to be taking all of this, moving it up, and taking the bills today. We're going to say five dollars going once. She brought. I'm sorry. My turn is coming here. Yes, your turn is coming, Marion. I thought you were asking me a question. No, I'm talking to my son. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, you were talking to me. That's okay. <laughs> All right, so we're going to call this to the Real Real Housewife. Angie, thank you so much. You are sold for $5. Marion, climb on board. Or I don't know if uh, Donna's going next. That's her choice. 
But thank you so much, Angie. Okay, Marianne, you're up. Okay, I got oh yeah, tangled everything up. I've got seven necklaces. They're cute. I'm gonna hold them up for seven dollars. I weighed it so I could send it first class. It's just under a pound, but some of them are are stones. Oh God, Let's see if I can straighten this out. I had them all straightened out. Here's a. These are sort of like shells. Can you see this? And it was seven nice. necklaces for five. Is that what you said? Seven necklaces for seven. Oh, seven. seven. One dollar each. Seven necklaces. Plus the shipping. There's a couple of chains in here. Nice chains with little trim. You can see that one. Okay, hey, you have to move it over to the left a little bit. There yeah. you go. Yeah. And I managed to drop one. One went on the floor. I have to look at it. This is really pretty. It's a stones, nice stones. And then there's this one too. This has a, a really pretty pendant. You there you that? go. That's perfect right oh, there. Wow. Yeah. Nice. Pendant. Nice black yeah. one. And this is kind of brown beads. Yeah, just hold it. There you go. That's the spot to hold it. That's number yeah. two. Uh, number three is this chain, which I managed to tangle it up. I think there's two chains here. I don't want to waste a lot of time untangling them. But they're coming, I, I guess. I feel like that's bound to happen with any piece of jewelry. It is going to tangle. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> anyway, there's two different chains here. And then this one, whoop, this goes this way. <laughs> okay. And then I have these two other ones a little shorter. This is, I don't know, I think it's kind of a shell. Yeah, it looks like I, shell and um, um, some beads mixed in. Yeah, it's a choker, It, but it has a little length on the back to make it longer. And then this one is like um, kind of, they're not, they're, they're, um, has a little color in a light pale uh, green. They look like, I think they're stone or glass. Okay, yeah, and, if I see them sparkling. Hello, Rico there. Man. There's Brandon. Welcome but, to the show. So, so I dropped one. Here's another, this is really pretty too, chain. That's oh, it. Yeah. Seven necklaces for seven dollars. So I can ship them first class. Yeah. Which is the cheapest. Well, we've got seven necklaces for seven dollars. Do we have any starting bids any for the necklaces? Yeah. If not, you can always type in pass. Hello, Ghost Pirate. How are you tonight? You can always type in pass and we can bring in other exciting items. Or if there's something in particular you're looking for, just type it in the chat. But otherwise, Marion has these beautiful necklaces. There's seven pieces, different various stones, shapes, sizes, types of class. But seven necklaces for seven dollars. It looks like there's no interest, Marianne. But if, of course, if anybody is interested in any of the necklaces, you can always contact Marianne. Her email is right there. Okay, so Brandon might know these cards. There, I have 30 of them. They come with the stickers, but the stickers are gone. To, to the puzzle. left. To the left. There you go. Know, yeah. Okay, those are wacky packs, uh, Marianne. You said there's okay. no stickers in the front. No, these are gone. Okay, so basically so what it is is they peel the stickers and the back becomes a puzzle. Yeah. So you think there's a demand for these? Uh, if the stickers were on, was on the front, definitely. Yeah, but they're not. That's the way I found them. They're older because I found them down in my storage room when I was cleaning out. Oh, yeah, wacky packs are definitely old. They were in the 80s. I don't know if I can't see the date from those, but
but you're talking about maybe like 85, 86, something yeah. like that. Yeah, all the stickers are gone on these. So I have about 30 of them. Any all right, did you have see. a starting bid on what you were starting it at? Oh, two dollars. Okay, so 30 wacky packs. Are you doing this, Flippin', or you want me to do it? No, oh, you can do it. I can hear you typing. Okay. <laughs> you know what they are. I don't. Yeah, I don't know what they are. They, they were similar to like, a, they were like an offshoot of Barbecue Kids. And yeah. basically, they made fun of uh, your everyday products. So, like, whatever your grocery store product was, they would turn it and make it funny and stupid or something like that yeah. so it was, it was like it was like garbage pail kids for grocery store items yeah oh okay. but they peeled the stickers off but left the backings so if like yeah. what she's showing there's something right there save one cent on some sort of dog food with a yeah. bone in it yeah, yeah. But it's, it's a it's a comedy for it so yeah so is there any interest no yeah, see, like I says, if they, if they had the stickers. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <That's a problem. laughs> I will good. say this, Mary, that is a polo item, though. If you ever see cards with stickers like that, yeah, that definitely is. Yes, it's a keeper. <laughs> yeah, yeah I, mean, I know. But it looks okay, like we have a pass. But, will they, but will, will they sell on eBay without the stickers? I didn't Possibly. I mean, if somebody's collecting the backings, I... I don't know. I mean, yeah. it comes to you can probably sell anything. Yeah. So I have these fall glitter curly birds. They're, each one is different. I have five of them. They're new on the card. To the left. To the left. Yeah. Yep. There you go. And I'm so, uh, five dollars for the five. And I'm sorry. What is it? You said a. Curly. Oh, they're birds. Okay. I they're see what birds. it is. And I think they have a little clip on, I don't know, you clip them wherever, on your clothes, on your tree. Put them on your tree. Yeah. And you're doing five of them for $5? Yeah. So you got clippable birds. Yeah, they're really cute. <laughs> Different colors. To the left, take it back now. One half the sun. Oh, you can clap your hands. Oh, clap them. <laughs> Yeah, teach me how to dance. <laughs> Lego man wants to do the cha cha slide. Yeah, we, we can't play the music because we don't want to get flipping in trouble. But it's like, it's yeah. green one. <laughs> take it back now. Any Got to stomp your foot as well. <laughs> no. Okay. Those are beautiful birds. Yeah, they're really pretty. You can attach them like like even uh, Donna said, attach them to your tree. Yeah, they if have you're a wearing like a, in the back. A headband, you can attach it to your headband. Yeah, you you can usually put it at the very top of the of the tree. You know, you instead of the put angel, put the bird up there. You <laughs> can put them wherever you want. Make it like a little hair clip. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. That's what I can use it. Any interest? <laughs> Any interest? Those are really pretty, though. Okay. Four or five. Okay. Well, if you, anybody's in the chat decides later they want it, just holler. Angie's right. Clip them on a wreath. It would make great yeah. um, crafting parties. Do we have a lag? We probably do have a lag. I didn't test it out earlier, but um, last lag. Uh. Okay, go ahead, Donna. Okay. Go ahead. Okay. Okay, I have a necklace. Dollar start. It's Nothing a wooden yet. necklace, 18 inches long. Um, has no clasp, so you just kind of throw it over your head and. Off you go. <laughs> it's uh, brown, um, brown wooden beads, and it has these big, big hoops on the bottom. Quite neat. It's kind of like geometric. 
And these are uh, these are actually brown beads right here. So the, the hoops are, are connected by brown beads. And this here is the biggest biggest hoop at the bottom. Sort of not sitting straight here. There we go. And it's quite long. As you can see, I just kind of pulled it up a little bit. Oops. There you go. Dollar start. So it looks like we're at a 15 second delay, which is not too bad, all things considering. Yeah. Hopefully it's it's better than it was. I guess I heard um, on uh, what night was it? Wednesday, they said that there was a blackout on YouTube. Oh wow! Yeah, I didn't. And even, I, I was I was looking at videos and I didn't have any problems viewing them. So um, I guess it was the people who were trying to show. Angie mentioned that they said that they were going fine live, but anybody who was in the audience. But they all ended up leaving the show. Like they were all uh -huh. booted out of the show. So, and I don't think there's anything major happening tonight. So, well, let's hope not. <laughs> no, just just Friday the thirteenth. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I, didn't, I didn't write your necklace. What was the starting bit? A dollar, a whopping dollar. <laughs> I just lost. Okay. The wooden 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 necklace, brown, brown wooden necklace for a dollar. Okay. okay, I lost it for a second. <laughs> necklace, one dollar. So we have starting bid on the necklace for a dollar. Makes a nice little long accentuating necklace. Yep. With a See, chain round circle. Is, it's very lightweight. And of course, if nobody is interested, you could simply type pass so yeah. that Donna could show more lovely stuff. Yep. Yeah. Well, I'll do that right now. <laughs> so next I have is a pin. I'm going to start this off at a dollar as well. Great bird cage toy. What the necklace? the necklace? Oh yeah, I guess the parrot. They love playing with things like. Oh well, okay, okay. This is a pin. It could be Chicago. Could be New York City. Could be any city for that matter. Dollar Thanks. start. All right, so we'll call it a cityscape pin, $1. Just a neat little pin. With what the kind same. of backing does, okay, it has a. Has, has the, the normal pin thing. Kind of hard to hold. And it's all metal? Yeah, I think so. Feels metal, but it's it's very lightweight though, so it's light weight metal. All right. Well it's an it's a beautiful, like metallic glittery iridescent. I see I don't know what the word is because as you're holding it, it, it shows like the shiny rainbow light colors. <laughs> well there there is the um an X, you know, it does have the the X, and I'm just trying to show that the the two office, the tall office buildings, it has three office buildings, and it, you know, it kind of doesn't want to show that, <laughs> so I'm kind of moving it. Like I said, it can be you know Chicago. I don't think it's it's. That's my phone. I don't think it's New York because none of the, the towers are um, the same height. Right. You're being summoned. <laughs> yeah, right.
I tease whenever somebody's phone rings or if it's just like, yeah, you're being summoned. <laughs> oh, the game. Jules. <laughs> we want okay. you back. It's come your back game. They want you to collect whatever it is or yeah, come right. <laughs> In no interest, we'll move on. Okay. Next, I have is a bracelet. And this one here is, um, I think it's uh, shelled. It's just painted different colors. Oh, my God. They're coming at me <laughs> every which way. <laughs> And what are you starting about a dollar? This is a, a bracelet with a uh, clasp that you um, twist, twist and open. What's what's the starting bit? A dollar? Dollar. One dollar. One dollar gets you in this nice, gorgeous bracelet. It's um, you know, shelled. Different colors. Very pretty. Looks like Fruit Loops. <laughs> well, I don't know about Fruit Loops. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> Fruit Loops. So for some reason, I want to because Fruit Loops is two cans down. For some reason, I'm getting the little image of the, the leprechaun with the, the rainbows, but that's Lucky Charms. Okay. <laughs> but I want to say those bracelets, I, I remember as a kid, I used to have those in white all the time. It was bracelets and like necklaces, and I forget what they call that type of design, but it was always white. <laughs> Oh, and that's a very this pretty color. It's me. A lot of times the uh, um, bracelets are, they're like really small. And I don't know, how the heck do you get your arm in there? <laughs> Puka shells. That's it. Thank you, Angie. Yeah, the shells. Any interest? I said it's quite pretty. You could easily just take it apart and make it make make your own. You know, string them up on a necklace. Oh, you, you want more? <laughs> Poke shells for the collection. Hello, Don's channel. Hi, Don. Welcome, welcome to Lady Side, where we probably have too much fun and laugh at our own products. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Any interest? If not, we're going to go to Melody. <laughs> You're going to me. What? What? What can I bring to the table? Yeah, all right. I hope you got something. <laughs> I got. I'll tell you what I got. I got trees. She's got trees. Oh, we're gonna start this off with five dollars. Okay. I am selling not one but two. Grow your own tree kits. So I'm gonna be starting with five dollars for both of them. And just to show you what it is, it's an American elm tree. It's a tree growing kit. It's everything needed to start your tree uh, growth cycle, whatever. It comes with the plant, the planter. It comes with the seeds. It comes with the plant food. It even comes with carbon. So I guess it'll, um, I don't know, it makes you grow your tree. So How much? Better? I'm sorry? How much? $5. Starting bid for $5 both. For, for two? Both, for both of them, yes. It makes great gifts. And why do I have a feeling there was just an accident outside? <laughs> Again? <laughs> There's always an accident outside. All, all you heard was a big crap. So, 
the last time my husband had to help because it was a motorcycle guy, I got hit by a car. My, oh, husband, wow. my husband's a um, EMT, but something just happened. So <laughs> she's gonna leave again. <laughs> I, I'm gonna leave for a minute. But do we have anybody for the trees? <laughs> <laughs> okay, if you don't mind, Marion, are you ready? Yeah. Okay, skip me for a minute because I, I did not check out what just happened. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> here I am. Here I am. I'm right here. Okay, we're going to skip to Marion. I'm going to go look at the accident and okay. I'll, report, I'll report back in a minute. So I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, I'm selling uh, three craft kits. Um, this one is a. Uh, can you see it? Heavenly Minstrels. Yep, we can see it. it. Yeah, it's uh, it's new, never been opened. It's a 15-inch diagonal felt applique stocking. Ooh. That's one. Then I have another one here. This is a bigger one. Same brand, that Brucella, which is a pretty popular brand. And this is a... Uh, uh, let me see what it is. <laughs> Good. It's um, Celestial Angels, 43-inch round tree, round tree skirt. That's this one. Can you, see, can you see it? Bigger package. How much? Uh, for the three, five dollars. Start over here. And then I have one more. This is a, I think it's, it's a cross stitch. Mother is always there. Seven inch round. Uh, it's cross stitch. And it comes with a ring. There's, there's, okay, it comes with that. that. Yeah, so all four pieces for $5. Any interest? Are they, um, are, are most of them new or are they, they have they been, they have they're all been brand new? Opened. They haven't been opened. Okay. They're brand new. I just got them today. They were in that storage unit. Okay. Wow. And I'm back. We do have Yellow Brick Road in at $5 for the craft kit. Okay. Do we have any other bids besides $5? You're going to get brand new. For the uh, cross stitch, you'll get this the ring. This is a big one. It's got all the felt. It's all cut already, ready to work on. You get the heavenly minstrel, and I can't see what that one is. And that's uh, another angel. This is an angel. This is a. One of the big one was a tree skirt. Yeah, this is a tree skirt. This is a 15 inch uh, applique stocking. Very nice collection for the holidays. If you don't finish it this year, you'll have it next year for a gift. <laughs> <laughs> makes a great gift or it makes a great to resell. And this is a brand new cross stitch. Hello, and Funky Fluffy's in the house. Hey, Funky Fit. Fl Ugh, I can't even say it. Fluffy, I can say Fluffy. Fluffy is in the house. Fluffy. Uh, this one has been opened, but it's, it hasn't been removed from from the package, so it's all there. So we have uh, Yellow Brick Road reselling at five dollars for the craft stitch. Any other? Has Yellow Brick Road brought for me before? Is uh, recognize you might name? not have, but uh, we have her information. If yeah, I have her information. Send me an email. Okay, I got to find my pen. Okay, so I guess we're going to call it to Yellow Brick Road for $5. Okay. Let me write that in. Sold to Yellow Brick Road. Okay, I got that too. All right, so. We appreciate it, Fluffy, you stopping by. I've got some yarn. Oh, I have some new skeins. Do people want skeins that aren't yet, are not new? 
of like a bunch of odds and ends. So I have five full skeins. Three of them are white, like this. I think they're all a red heart. How much were you starting to bid at? This one doesn't look quite full to me. I don't know. Um, five dollars for the five. Five dollars. That's that is an incredible price for five skeins I'm of sure yarn. One has got gone up, and then I do have a lot of odd, not full ones that would include if they wanted them. We have Judith in for five dollars. She okay. knows. Um, Judith, so we see the the stop sign, but. Yeah, I don't see the bid. We don't see the bid, just the stop sign for five, if that's <laughs> what you are talking about. And this person started this, made these little things. So if they wanted this, you know. Oh, it looks like they started in Afghan. There's a lot of pieces. Yep, all you got to do is sew them together. You got yourself an Afghan or a baby blanket. Yeah, it was crocheted because here's a crochet needle. Yeah. So She's saying no. To... What's the no for? No, okay. she doesn't have a bid. I don't get this. <laughs> Judith, were you bidding for the yarn or were you bidding for the kits? She had a six dollar bid for the kits. Okay, that never came up. Back on it up. Never what? saw that. They're talking, they'll do it. The, the one and only bid we have is Yellow Brick Road at $5. Yeah. Does she want to go six? Hmm. I'm sorry, Judith. Unfortunately, we did not get the bid at the time. And we did move on to the next item. Above the stop sign, there's nothing above. That was your first and only comment in the chat. So then we went to the five skeins of yarn for $5. Yeah, the first time I saw her was when she had the stop sign in. Okay, I got another skein, a whole package of red yarn. So maybe the bid will go up for $5. They started this little doodad on well, the As of right now, we are bidding for the yarn. Unfortunately, for the kits, the kits were sold to Yellow Brick Road for $5. We are on the yarn right now. And um, okay. I'm right That's under. Cool. And whoever buys the yarn, do they want these? There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, I don't know why Judith nine. did not show up. And I mean, I'm verifying it by everybody. We're all looking at it. There's no. Um, I, the first it. time she put in anything is when she put in the stop sign. Correct. That's the first time I see her, I don't see her any place else. That is correct. That's the same thing I'm getting. I see the real, real housewife said fluff came by. Came, came by to buy me some stuff, and then you put in five scans of yarn. That's, I don't see her anywhere. Okay, well, shall we call the yarn? I don't know. Do we have anything for nobody? Bid, for nobody bid for the yarn. No. I thought somebody bid for it. No. No, uh, that, that was, she was stopping for the other one. I'm sorry, okay. Judith. I got seven skeins now and these little thing, a bunch of these too. So you're doing seven skeins for $5? Yep. And, okay. and these, if somebody wants these too. If anybody is interested in the yarn, it's seven skeins for $5. Well, if they knew how to make people mods, I'd do it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, wait a minute. Melanie's a mod. That's that's what I'm doing. I'm watching the chat. I'm watching it live through um, on YouTube. I didn't see okay. any bid for you, Judith. I'm really sorry. Okay, was that my third item? It could be that there was an error 
when you posted it, or maybe it did come up, just make sure that you were on live chat and not top chat. I do one more. Are you ready, Melanie? Uh, she can do one more. Let her finish out her three. Yeah, yeah you can do one more. Uh, okay. Then we'll go back to me if that's all right. Okay, this is a Hallmark keepsake ornaments. They're really different. They're new in the pa package. And let's see. This is the box. And how much are we doing the keepsake ornament? This is $5. Back, back away a little bit. Back away, back away. People are going to want to see that box. Okay. These are Turn it around so they can see all the way around. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I think this is from 2002. I'm not quite sure. They were sculpted by somebody. This is Santa Claus. They have a whole description on the back. Uh, let me try to show you, show them to you. They're wrapped up in the package still. I guess it's kind of hard, but it's Mr. and Mrs. Santa Claus. They're like three little figures. I hate to open them. No, no, don't open them, Marion. Yeah, I'm not. <laughs> if something's in a package like that, never open it. Just leave it in. <laughs> okay. They're really cute. They're small, like. We have Lisa's treasure in at $5 for the Hallmark Keepsake Ornaments. Okay. They are really, really cute. Okay. And here's one more in the corner. I think there's four ornaments in the box. There's four all together? Yeah. yeah, if you could show the box again, that would be yeah. great. So they can actually see the pictures on the box. Okay. And we have Lisa's treasure in at $5. You're getting three different three-piece ornament set. Four pieces, isn't it? Or is Four, it well, it says three-piece on it. It's yeah. from oh, okay. 2001. Yeah. Yeah, three pieces. I have more of this kind of thing, maybe $5 each, if, if she wants some other ones. Take care, Fluffy. Have a good night, and we appreciate you visiting. Thank you. And we Thanks have Lisa coming. Treasury at five. Any other bids for those Hallmark ornaments? Mm -hmm. If not, we could start calling into Lisa. Does Lisa want some other Hallmark ornaments like this? Well, you want to show it the next round? Um, you can yeah. show the other ones. Yeah, we'll show them the next round. Okay. So we're going to put Lisa going once. And she's got for maybe four. Yeah. Going twice. Okay. We are going to say sold to Lisa's treasures. Thank you. Thank you. $5. Okay. I'll have to check my schedule, Fluffy. See see how much stuff I have to get rid of. <laughs> okay, Melanie, you up? I'm up. <laughs> so I do have to apologize. I am on a main road, which accidents frequently happen in front, but the accident happens like down the road, so I'm not even gonna worry about it. But yeah, like there's always an accident directly in front of the building. Anyway. In case anybody was interested, I'm just showing the trees one more time. They are elm trees, self-watering little trees. I'm doing both of them for $5. I didn't see anybody make a bid, but if you are interested, I'm just showing it real quick. Um, both trees, $5, makes a great holiday present or a gift. But what I'll do is I'll move on to the next item, being that I was in the middle of it and... Like I said, got interrupted. But good news is it looks like nobody uh, got injured.
Okay, the next item of Pervade is I'm doing a set of two Wilton cake pans. The first one is going to be Winnie the Pooh, and this is a Walt Disney production uh, for Wilton. There's no date on it. I'm going to do both of them for $5. And then Strawberry Shortcake. And Strawberry Shortcake, this is from 1981. They're both Wilton. They're classic um, cake pans. Great for the holidays, great for decorations. I'm going to write it in the cake pans. It would be two for five. If anybody, if I can just type, that would be great. You'll get both of them. They're in excellent condition. There is some wear and age on them, but you'll get Winnie the Pooh and you'll get strawberry shortcake with a cute little strawberry. Both of these for $5. Great if you're a baker for holidays, you want to impress them with a unique design, you can give them many of the both. It also works for jello molds if you want to do like a jiggly jello um, creation. And you'll get both of these pans for $5. Also works great in the uh, snow country, you know, pack them with snow. Oh, making snow. Yes. I never even thought about that. Yeah, I'll make it your metal. Yeah, make this not, like maybe in your snow banks or something so the people going by can see them. <laughs> if you have that much ice, you can have like uh, Winnie the Pooh and Charles. There you go. <laughs> you would have to be creative up here. <laughs> that is one thing I do not miss is the snow. I never <laughs> like the snow. I never like shoveling. Would have to wake up hours beforehand just to get my car out of the snow. No, I do not miss that. <laughs> but then again, the downside is Texas closes down if they just get a little bit of ice. Uh. They can't do it. <laughs> 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 but that is okay. I've got two Wilton cake pans. If anybody's interested, selling both of them for $5, you can contact me at any time for that. Okay, but the next item we're going to do is, I thought this was a pretty cool set. Um, I'm going to write it down. It is a calligraphy set. And we're going to start the bid at $3 for this. Um, very interesting. It's from Faber Castell. They've been around since 1761. It's a getting started calligraphy set. You learn the art of um, calligraphy, of uh, penmanship, of lettering. Um, it's from Creative Studios. It comes with all the different color. Uh, but it's a 13-piece set. All together, <laughs> you get snow like that in Georgia. Exactly, that's what happens over here, Lisa. But that only happens with ice. If it even begins to ice up, Texas closes down. Um, what was I saying? Okay, so this is a complete book on um calligraphy, and it gives you the different pencils, a sharpener, the markers, and teaches you how to do the different lettering. So it makes a great gift. It is brand new. Just some cosmetic issues to the outside package and we have the real housewife in for three dollars she is scooping up on the deals for gifts we have any other bids besides three dollars and this is from the faber castell collection nice little art collection if anybody is interested if not we will start calling it to angie and we're going to say Angie going once. Real, real housewife going twice. Angie, congratulations. Sold. You want a calligraphy set for $3. Um, Donna, I think we're going to go to you because that was my three. And I know we skipped Marion. Back okay. and be you with them back to, if that makes sense. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Like, okay. <laughs> no, thank you, Angie. I really, really appreciate this. <laughs> okay, I have a, a necklace. Um, it's uh sort of gold. Well, not gold. It's uh sort of green, green, red tone beads with uh kind of a can't tell with this light. It looks gold. I think they're um gold tone um spacers in between so dollar, hey, dollar is it just a necklace or it comes with earrings as well no just a necklace 
Okay, I, it's like double. All right, I didn't see what the yeah, top. Yeah, it's was. doubled at the top. It, it there's no. Uh, it's the kind where you just kind of put it over your head. It's not a. Um, and I should have me measured it while I was waiting for everybody to chime in. <laughs> It's 17 inches long. Oh, there you go. It, it comes down that far. So you can see, I just kind of like circled it around. So, dollar start. You can either wear it or take it apart, use the beads. It's great for jewelry makers if you do that. That's Reuse right. And repurpose them for your own designs. Yeah. I don't have the patience for that. I am not artistic at all. I can't work with uh, small, um, even like opening and closing the, the, the clasp. Mm -hmm. You know, either the clasp, it doesn't matter what it is. I have a tough time with that. And, and trying to put the backs on, on jewelry, on, on earrings, it's like, ooh. <laughs> and plus, I just don't have the patience for that. <laughs> so jewelry well, we making to me is out, but I will at least sell or buy. <laughs> it's pretty. Hand it over to the next person who would enjoy the qualities of the jewelry or the jewelry making process. That's right. Give it more of the therapeutic. I don't know. <laughs> so is anyone interested in it? And if there's no interest, you could simply type pass. Or I'll just move on. Or, of course, you can move on right to the next one. Next I have is a uh, black and gold tone uh, bracelet. There's two of them, and they um, have little bells at the bottom of them. And you can make me able to hear them. They're jingling. They're jingling, yes, they jingle. So you can you as well? all set for uh, Christmas. $1? Uh, um, $2. $2. Doing two dollars. It could also be like a um a door hang where you hang it on the doorbell, the doorknob. So when you, you open could, the door, it, it's very light. <laughs> oh, it's very light. Okay. I don't think you would hear the door open. You would need a heavier bell. Ah, okay. You need like a cowbell on that. <laughs> More <than> cowbell. <laughs> yeah. Maybe if you um, loop them together and then put the cowbell at the bottom, you could do it that way. You'd be like, more cowbell! Go jingle, 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 jingle! <laughs> yeah, so they are they are actual little bells back there. I don't know if you can see that. They, they move. It's not moving. Anyone? Anyone out there? Hey, it's too early to do the Bueller thing. You can't do that. Too early for what? A Bueller. Where is like Bueller? No. <laughs> Where's Bueller's day off? Where's that? There's like Bueller. Bueller. Anyone? Nope. Too early for that. <laughs> we just got this party started. It's ladies night. You know how it is. Yeah. Friday night, it's the end of the week, and it's like, oh, yeah, I work too much. I work too hard. And now my party is canceled. No. It's time to spend some money. <laughs> I'm so upset my party's canceled. Ah. Nobody wants to venture out. I'm hearing voices. So what is this? My two? So I you got, got, huh? got one more. I got one more. You got Let's one see. more. Hold on. I'll put 
throw this up. This is a wooden necklace with cork. And it's about eight inches long. Wood necklace? Yep. Dollar start. Has a um has a class. It's the um circle clasp. And this this here is cork. You know, like the cork in a wine bottle. And these two is also cork as well. And the beads itself are wooden. It's cool, but it looks like a gigantic marshmallow from a distance. <laughs> it's not. I know it's not. It does. <laughs> I'm like, it makes me just want to like roast some marshmallows outside. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so we have a cork thin necklace that is not marshmallows but it does have a squiggly on it for one dollar do you have any bids if not we could simply pass and go on to the next thing. <laughs> yeah. So who am I passing it to? You or Marion? You, know, you want to go back in order like that? or? Yeah, I'll go back. I'll, no, I'll go back to you and then go back to Marion. Okay. Right, she's so. not ready anyways. <laughs> okay, that'll be the original one. <laughs> We're going to take a nice little interlude anyway while you go to me. Yeah. <laughs> since, the, since the chat quieted down, that's okay. I've got a special little surprise. Oh, my here. God. Look at you. She's got a little baby. What do you mean? Look at me. Okay. <laughs> this little creepy thing is whatever you want to call it. This is really <laughs> yes. This is okay. Wait, wait. I, I, I'm going to do a bad thing. This is not a real baby, but yeah, I got to do this. Okay. So this is. <laughs> This is a 1999 Lee Middleton original doll. Okay, I'm going to write that in because check the comps on these babies. These are amazing. So Lee Middleton doll. I know there's so few, but I'm going to put it. It's probably the closest I'll get to a grand child. Yes, I'm putting a crazy amount in, but... If you see the prices of how much these dolls are, you'll see, Melanie, why are you only selling it for $30? But this particular one is a 1999 real doll. It is weighted exactly like a baby. This thing is heavy, and it does the little suck my thumb thing, so you can have them. Um, he's the thumb sucker version. <laughs> That's if you call it a, a boy. I, I think it's a boy. It could be a girl, but and it has purple eyes which is even creepier. But if you don't want him to suck his thumb, you could just pull that out and put the little pacifier back in there. So these are the babies that are perfect for like, uh, if you have um, children that you want to teach them how to hold the baby, or if you have um, any um, elderly with uh, dementia issues, they make great babies because they're like real babies. And I'm selling this particular real baby for $30. But I just thought that was cute because, like I said, you can bounce them. you got to be careful because then their head goes back. So it really literally is. You've got to train yourself to hold it like a real baby. And it, it's creepy. To me, I think this thing is like haunted. Now, does it wet and, and change the diaper and all that? There is. In fact, here, um, wait, wait, wait. It, it doesn't wet, but it does have a diaper on. See that? <laughs> Actually, honestly, I don't even know if it wet. I don't think it does. That would be creepy. That that would scare me even more if all of a sudden I'm hitting here, sitting here, and I'm like feeling something. I'm like, what did you do? What's her name? It is a Lee Middleton, and it's oh. um number three one nine nine nine. That's Ooh, that would be company. They make Lee Middleton. Okay. Lee Middleton is the company name. So. Um, there's no box. I'll put the model number down. It's number, because uh, like I said, check the comps. 
And it is amazing how much these things sell for. Three one nine 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 nine. And I'm selling this real baby for thirty dollars. And it's it's a cute little Lee Milton model number three one nine nine nine, not six six six, but nine nine nine. Well, you you miss you miss the Betsy Wetsy. You had a Betsy Wetsy. Who I had, had a Betsy Wetsy? You 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 give it its bottle. It'll and drink the bottle. And go, you can see the bottle being empty, and then five minutes later, it'll be all out, and you gotta change the diaper. That is awful. <laughs> did you change it or did you get all wet and everything? Mm, no. <laughs> all right. I think I'm gonna have to put you back on the shelf. Hopefully, you don't start crying. No, it doesn't cry or anything. But it is weighted. These things are very heavy. So that is something I'm introducing. If anybody is interested, I actually have um, a couple of those styles. So if anybody is interested in Lee Middleton, Middleton just contact me. <laughs> and then how about belts? Does anybody like belts? All right, we're gonna say belt collection. We're gonna put uh, three dollars. Choice. I can't spell. Huh? I have got. Oops. Yes, they are beautiful babies, and they come in all different types of styles and, and colors and eye color and hair color. And that one is just to me, it's creepy. But anyway, we are doing a belt collection. There's three different belts here. I'm doing a three starting bid three dollars choice. If anybody is interested, the first one is a metal elephant. The second one is actually a Chico's style, and it is from the company Chico's. It has the little uh, Chico brand, and this is a big sand dollar blue shell, and they are very very pretty. They run relatively on the small side, but just to show you the backs. They are adjustable. This one is just a regular cord one. This one is a metal adjustable one. And this one, I simply put the whole belt right here. And it's hard to see. Oh, you're not going to be able to see it. But it does have the little Chico's heart thing that says Chico's on it that identifies the company. So it is a Chico's belt. If anybody's interested, we're doing a choice. $3 starting bid, or you could take all three for $3 each, unless there's any other bids, which is a steal for these type of belts, which are absolutely gorgeous. Great if you have an Etsy shop. I do not have an Etsy shop. Or if you have a Poshmark, I think you could sell uh, belts on Poshmark as well. You can sell almost anything on, on Poshmark now, except for DVDs, electronics. Oh, you can? On, oh, so they opened it up? So you can sell toys. Okay. Maybe maybe I might look into that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Christmas, you can sell Christmas stuff there too. And crafts. Do you have you have a Poshmark account or no? Yeah, I do. <laughs> uh, maybe I gotta look into it because I mean I do Macari, I do eBay, I do uh marketplace, but it's like, yeah, I'm always looking for more stuff. Why not? There you go. Hey, YouTube alone takes forever. <laughs> But it looks like at this time, there's no interest in the belts. As with anything that I put up here, you can always contact me at any time if you're interested. Was that my third item? No, that wasn't my third item. That was my second item. That was your second item. Ah, that was my second item. All right. I've got something else. This is an odd item. Dr. Pepper Percolator. And this one, pricey but good. Um being for the collector's factor of it. This is a classic percolator, but it is a Dr. Pepper version. The company is called West Bend. It does three to five cups. And the whole object was that down here in Texas where uh, Dr. Pepper is huge. Never realized that because I was up in New York and nobody drinks Dr. Pepper up there. But down here, Dr. Pepper is crazy. And they made a original coffee pot percolator. All the plugs and stuff are in here. It works without any problem, but they say try Dr. Pepper hot for the medicinal value 
of Dr. Pepper. So you put your Dr. Pepper in here, heat it up and plug it in and you can have boiling hot Dr. Pepper. Ew. <laughs> what do you mean ew? I you should have to turn it up. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, look at that yellow brick road. I'm just diet Dr. Now you could put your diet Dr. Pepper in here. Plug it. <laughs> I would think you want to put coffee in there. <laughs> it is a percolator, so yes, you can put your coffee, you can put your hot chocolate, your tea, anything. It is a warmer. There is some cosmetic issues to it. Like there is just very, very little rusting here. But it works. <laughs> if you remember, going way back when, Dr. <laughs> going way back when, Dr. Pepper was an elixir as medicine. So that's why. <laughs> so see, Ghost Pirate has it. Back in the days, you drink hot Dr. Pepper. <laughs> For its medicinal value. I thought Dr. Pepper came from um, some little town in Virginia. Um, actually, uh, Dublin, the most famous one is Dublin Dr. Pepper, which is over here in Texas. The problem is they lost their uh, right to use the Dr. Pepper logo. So now they changed it to Dublin, Dublin uh, Bottle Works. But they were one of the original Dr. Pepper um, distribution distributors. Okay, but the original Dr. Pepper came from Virginia. I, I was so. on a bike tour. I was on a bicycle tour, and we went through this one little town, saying, saying that this is the place that Dr. Pepper originated from. It might have been. I don't know. I don't. I really don't know the story of Dr. Oh, Pepper. Okay. What <laughs> hey, is it? I, you know, I'm from New York. Me coming down here and everything is Dr. Pepper. I'm like, no, where is the Coke? <laughs> I want the Coke. No, nope, it's all Dr. Pepper. <laughs> but, okay, Angie, I just have to say this. You, you took the comment of the night. I love that. I should just highlight that. I never I never heard of that crop of food before. Love it. <laughs> makes... Make them up as she goes. You know something? Yes, I do make things up as I go along sometimes on the fly. But this is legit. It is hot on your pepper. That, that is a thing. <laughs> but I, I'm going to say wah, wah, wah. Nobody's interested in the hot <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> So somewhere out there, there will be someone who will love my hot Dr. Pepper. <laughs> Is that my three? I think I think that was three, wasn't I think it? That was three. Yeah, yeah. I, I think uh, um, Marion is up. <laughs> Angie, yeah. you want to be like now we're nuts? <laughs> more of these Hallmark ornaments. Oh, got Hallmark they're, ornaments coming up. They're, they're all new in the box. They're from 2002. Oh, this is a little Christmas tree with the decorations. Well, that is adorable. How much are we starting the bid on for that? $5. $5. Okay, so this is an eight-piece ornament. There's eight little tiny pieces on the tree. You want me to take it out? Um, No, I don't think mm -hmm. that. Yeah, always keep the ornaments in. You don't want to take that unless yeah, somebody wants to. Mess it up. <laughs> It has a whole yeah. story on the back. Is it oh, yeah. new in the box? What? New in the box? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, you don't they're want to take them out. The yeah, you don't want to take them out. Particularly yeah, if it has a seal on it or anything. Has a what? A seal. If it's if it's a sealed box, you never want to open up the box. No, these boxes are not sealed. Okay. They're, they haven't been removed because at the top is the cardboard here. Okay. And I can just open that cardboard. I get my fingers, and you could kind of see it. Oh, okay. The, yeah. The little ornaments are wrapped in that bubble wrap. Yep. Stuff. So that's that one. I have three of them, three different ones. They could choose or take them all, whatever. 
This one is the reindeer. Oh, that's cute. Oh, I like that one. Does it light up? <laughs> I don't think so. Oh, okay. I've, I've had Hallmark ornaments where they lit up and... These are a little different than the ones they sell now. They're from 2002, so 18 years old, so they've changed. But this is the reindeer. Like what? And uh, it's all in the original box. Then I Does have it another five dollars. <laughs> the reindeer. And then I have uh, this one's a lot heavier. This is Santa's sleigh. Can you read it? It has. Oh yeah, with the set of two ornaments. So I haven't. Yeah, so it's it. a little uh, gift bag and the looks like a top. The sleigh. Let's see how hard it is to get it out. Ah, it's in this styrofoam. Yeah. I need to take it out. Hard to get there. <coughs> Five dollars each. So we're doing a choice set on the Hallmark ornaments. Yeah, Five dollars. One or three. They're all from two thousand two. I'm gonna have some more after this. But we'll do these. Three. And we had yellow bro uh, yellow bro groceries for what? five dollars. <laughs> she what? She's telling Lisa to wake up. You got a bid for five dollars. Is there any other bids besides five? Which one if they want? Well, uh, oh, it's by choice. Well, let's by see choice. if anybody else bids. Five dollars each. Oh, so it's not a bid then. It's choice. Well, it's five dollars each. If somebody else bid, then it's choice. But I think I think Gilbert Road is the one and only bidder for this. We'll yeah. start calling it to her. Okay. See, she already chose what yeah, she wants. She wants the reindeer and tree. <laughs> she wants the reindeer and the tree. <laughs> These two? Okay. You got right. two of them. Now, does anybody else would like the sleigh? And Lisa so, would like to slay. Okay, so um, with Yellow Brick Road, I'll combine the shipping with the other stuff she bought. Yeah, okay. definitely. Yeah. And three. So you want me to do more? And Lisa is doing the slay. Okay, that's that one. Go that way so you can see it in the chat. Okay, let me put this down here and this here, and then Lisa's here. I gotta get another card I'm running out of paper. Lisa. Five Congratulations, Lisa. Congratulations, Yellow Brick Road. You got some cute little ornaments. Okay. Is that my three? No, that was only one. Yeah, that was only one. That was a choice. Okay. Here's another one. Uh, this is, um, what is this? It says journal on it. Santa's Big Night 2002. It's a big box. Oh, over to the left so we can see it. There you go. Santa's Big Night 2002 membership ornaments. Oh, so it's more than one. Maybe you got these when you were a member. Four pieces. How much did you want to start off with that? Five dollars. Because it's a four-piece set. Yeah, it's th this all in this box. Okay. Let's see how it's packed. I'm going to open it. I just brought these home. Oh, here it is. This afternoon. Yeah, this over to the left. To the left, to the left, to the left. There you go. Now bring All it right. down a little. Back it up a little. Back it up. There you go. Okay, so it's four ornaments uh, in a journal set with Santa, a stool, a little couch. And I don't. This should I mean, it must be, be the bag. Money. This should be ten dollars, shouldn't it? 
Well, you do have a bidding already at five dollars to Lisa Treasure. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Tamara, you want to come in at uh, ten? <laughs> <laughs> We've got a. <laughs> oh, this is really cute. Let me see this. Andrew's like, go, Lisa, go. I guess right, you we'll leave this in the box like this if you're a collector. 2002 or not. Okay, so I'm going to say we're going to call it to Lisa going once. Okay. $5. Say going twice. We're going to say sold to Lisa for $5. That's okay, Mary. And you get a nice little bundle going together and it works out. Yep. Yep. So that's two. I'll give you one more. Yep. You got one more. One more. This Take is a ornaments. Santa Claus set of two ornaments. Whatever they are. Here. I always go the wrong direction. <laughs> one of these days I'll learn. And what are you starting that five dollars as well? Yep. Yep. Okay, so we got Santa Claus with a little panda bear. Oh, who Put was them down there? The tiny one. Isn't that cute? Who likes panda bears? There was somebody who absolutely loved pandas. Do you remember who that is? I have no idea. No. There's somebody that floats around in the auction that always wants anything with panda. Any bits? You've got Lisa in at five dollars. She's collecting all those ornaments. Okay, she's got three so far. Any other bids for the keepsake ornament? If not, we will call it to Lisa. Okay. Yep, we're gonna call it to Lisa. Congratulations, Lisa. Hey, Lisa, your name is Panda. <laughs> 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 She bought, she bought from me yeah, right. The one who likes pandas, her name is Panda. That's right. The one who loves Panda. Uh, I didn't realize that. <laughs> four all together now. Okay. okay. I was having a moment. So, yes, if you see Panda floating around, she's the one that loves pandas. <laughs> okay. It's my turn. <laughs> it's your turn. <laughs> I have an 18-inch um, necklace of a cross and um, two pierced earrings, silver tone, and I'm going to start this at $3. Cute. It looks like a nice little Celtic design, I guess. Well, not really, but nice little... Cross. Yeah, there's there's some some sort of design on it. Um, it is um. If I could pick it up, it's kind of like like that on the back. And I pulled the card out. I can't really, but that that's that's the back of it. It's already taped up and everything, and you can see that there the posts are from the earrings. So three dollars. This cute little set. Christmas. Um birthdays. Communion. I'm trying to think what else. <laughs> well it's perfect. It's already set up in a box so it makes it nice and easy just to get yep. gifts. Comes comes with a lid. <laughs> Angie has lots of necklaces and moles. <laughs> she what? I have. I think she's trying to say she has a lot of necklaces and moles. Oh, she's oh. a lot of jewelry, so she's like, I have a ton of that stuff. We'll have some more. This is in a gift box. <laughs> It's like all oh. mm. 
Anyone interested? If if you're uh, watching this um after after it's over, you know, just let me know. Send me an email or make a comment down below that you will look like this. I actually do get sales that way. That's what's great about it is you have your email right up there. People contact you after the fact. Yeah. Mix and match deals. <laughs> She's looking to unload hers. <laughs> you can buy mine. Oh, my God. <laughs> it looks like there's no interest in the necklace, Donna. Uh, okay. Not a problem. It will be done later. Let's see. What do I got? I've got a glass. I don't really care for the chain that it's on. But you can change the chain out with something else. But this is a glass. Um, this be great for people who go to... Um, Encinos, because it's a um, dice. Oh! Not that you can roll it or anything, because it has the, um, you know, like a the little, um, the candies that has the twisties. Yeah. To it, the mints and stuff. That's that's what it has, but it's it's glass. The whole thing is glass. And for this one, uh, two dollars. Two dollars. So it is like a green glass dice candy. Yeah. That is cute. It's not candy to eat. It's just, you know, that's what it looks like. I mean, like I said, the chain is, is nothing but this uh, um, silver ball type chain. But it's basically, I'm, I'm, I'm selling the, uh, the glass candy dice <laughs> yeah you could always change out the chain i mean that's yeah the put it on something else a little, a little bit more fancier than this thing make it your little lucky candy that's right it's got all the um all the spots on that you would normally have on a dice Got two, three, one. Or if not, you can use the ball chain for artistic uh, painting. They they show painting videos on how you can use those chains to paint with. Where they hit the paint, they hit the the thing the the. Picture with the with the chains, mm -hmm. or do they paint right over them? It's a combination of things. It's like you take the um, you dip the ball chain in the paint, and then you could either smear it around the canvas, or it's one of those things where you pull it through the paint. I mean, they have different techniques using uh -huh. that ball chain. Okay, yeah. Or if not, you can replace your, uh, what do you call it? Um, your little string on your lights. <laughs> <laughs> I have a switch. <laughs> <laughs> a little pull strings or whatever you call those things. Yeah, right. <laughs> no interest? Let's see, what else can I find? Um, ma, 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 ma. how about this? This, I believe, is 18 inches long. Who likes owls? Anyone out there like owls? I don't think I've ever shown this yet. It has a lobster class. As you can see from there. I'm going to pull it up because it's kind of lost. That There's is owl. He looks angry. Well, it is the 13th. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we're going to call it. Angry Owl. <laughs> All right. It's got, um, I can't really tell with this darn light. I meant to bring the other light in. Are you doing it, 
Twelve for that or a different price? Um, two dollars. Yeah. It, um, it's green. It's green tone. Um, it's dark green. It's sitting on a perch. Little little um. This here is the twig <laughs> that it's sitting on. It does have two. It almost looks like glass eyes. And unfortunately, you can't see it from here. They kind of do sparkle. So if I can get the eyes to sparkle. There we go. Yeah, you can see it a little you bit. It's like little it now. Yeah. And it's it is dark. green. It's a dark green. It's like uh, forest green. The eyes are forest green as well? Or no, the, the body of the owl is 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 forest green. The eyes are blue okay. and they sparkle. There's like uh, um, two tiny little gems in there and they're blue. Okay, yeah, because I was going to say you definitely see the blue in the eyes. It looks, it doesn't look green to me, but that's simply the color lighting. Yeah, the, the owl itself is green. And they have, they have it on, on a dark chain. That doesn't help it much either. <laughs> it's like angry owl. If I bring it in a little better. There, now you can see it. You can see the blue in the eyes. He's kind of cute. Going, whoo, whoo, who out there? <laughs> and if there's no interest in the owl, you can simply type pass. Or we could go to the next item. Which will be, was that two? Um, actually, no, that was three. You did the 18 inch the dice at the owl. Okay. So okay. We'll just go to Melanie. Me. Oh, we're up to me. Yeah. Hey. You, you ready? <laughs> yes. Oh, we got two passes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I am going to do a Barbie lot. How about that? We're going to do Barbie and choose. Because Barbie has a, a shoe thing going. Uh, we're going to start this off at $12. How about that? I am going to do not one, but two Barbie dolls. So you're going to get two Barbie dolls. Um, this is like a punk rocker Barbie doll with her little steampunk head. This is a beautiful uh, red dress Barbie. And they have the jointed um, little movements. And not only that, I'm going to give you an entire bag of Barbie shoes. I don't know how many pairs are in here. It's just a complete collection of shoes. And I'm pretty sure they're all there because when I look at it, I do see all the doubles, but I didn't take them out and look at them and count them or anything like that, but you have shoes. So we're starting this off at $12 for two Barbies and a bag of shoes. Lots and lots of shoes. Great for, if you have Barbie dolls, great if you resell Barbie dolls, great if you just want to dress up all your Barbies in shoes. They wear nothing but shoes. <laughs> yeah, I was bad when I was young. I used to like top off the hair of the Barbies. Oh, I did. I took the scissors because I was thinking in my head that the hair would grow back. So oh. I was, like cut there, and then it, it then it would cut their head. I don't know why. I always did that. My mother said to me, "It's like stop cutting the hair." And I'm like, "It's gonna grow back." No, they never grow back. I ruined all my Barbie dolls. <laughs> but if anybody's interesting, we got two Barbies and a big bag of shoes. And there's some pretty shoes. You've got like big boots, you've got uh, ice skates, you've got rose, you got sexy, sexy shoes, all kinds of shoes. I tell you, if anybody's out there that are, that are resellers, <clears throat> hint, 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 that's a hot item on eBay. Hint, hint. <laughs> I know that. 
And yet, why is it that I, I'm an eBay reseller and why don't I spend time to do this? Because I just don't have fun. That's what it is. All right. Well, if anybody is interested in Barbies or shoes, contact me because I actually have a lot of Barbie stuff. I do. Lots and lots of Barbie stuff. That was a bolo. That was a bolo. Now we're going to do a T-shirt lot. And we're going to start this off. I like the number 12. We'll start this off at $12. Let me show you what you're going to get because you are getting multiple shirts. You're not just getting one shirt. Let me just put it on so I can actually see. Okay. So the first thing you're going to get is this is... Harley Davidson, Mosul, Iraq from Harley Davidson. This is not an original one. This is, well, it is, but it's Harley Davidson, Mosul, Iraq. This is from a enthusiast who also happened to be a, um, ah, in the military. So he had a whole bunch of shirts designed in honor of it. So this one, Harley Davidson, Mosul, Iraq, the back. This is size small. Then you're going to get size extra large Operation Iraqi Freedom. And that's a nice little uh, shirt for that. That's one sided. You're going to get size large. This is an authentic Hard Rock Cafe shirt, size large. And it has the Hard Rock logo. And it is from, look at that, Dubai. Hard Rock Cafe Dubai. And then you're going to get size large, and this is just a specialty long sleeve shirt, Operation Iraqi Freedom Coalition Forces. So it is a collection of four shirts for men, different sizes, $12 in honors. Thank you, Angie, for stopping. Good luck with your show. And have a good one. We appreciate you supporting us tonight. Yeah, thanks, thanks for coming, Angie. And I will send you an invoice with everything. I appreciate it, Angie. So if anybody is interested, we have the Harley Davidson, we have the Iraqi Freedom, and we have the Hard Rock Cafe t-shirt lot. You'll get four t-shirts all together for $12. Very nice collection. Davidson. Have a good night. Rocky Freedom. So she's doing a late night show today. Yeah, I, I'm I'm an Earl. I it's like I have to go to sleep early. <laughs> That's why by this time it's like ah I'm tired. <laughs> Are they single stitch or double? These are not vintage. Oh, okay. No, they um double stitch. You know, somebody asked that the last time. I'm like, they are not vintage. In fact, uh, te technically, I say technically, this one is not a branded. It doesn't have the Harley logo on the inside. So that's why I said this is like an enthusiast. I'll put it that way. <laughs> But uh, the Hard Rock one is authentic, and the um, that's it. The Hard Rock one is authentic. <laughs> the rest of them were specialty made. So. But that is okay if anybody is interested in T-shirts. I have T-shirts. T-shirts are not my thing. <laughs> that's that. And then the final thing is I am going to do a very, very cute, Trinket box. Let me write it in. It is an Andrea. Andrea by Sedek box. And we're going to start that off at $3. This is a cute little, I could put that Andrea by Sedek made in Japan. Cute little beautiful trinket box. Has a gorgeous flower, rose, whatever kind of flower that is very cute you can have it as a jewelry jar a trinket jar i don't know candy jar makeup jar whatever you want to keep it something earrings something that you want to keep it's a japanese i don't know what the significant if that's just a model number or 
whatever, 6886 or 9886. Don't know what that means, but it is a cute, it has the gold, the painted trim on it, like that. And there's no cracks, there's no um, chips or anything like that. It's in great condition. Selling it for three dollars. Could use it as a jewelry jar. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why I see your little tiny trinkets, little. And if there's no interest, simply type half. I don't think there's anybody left to type. That's all right. I know there's multiple shows going on tonight. Yeah, I know there's one, another, one starting. Yeah, and, and when they hear something that's of interest, that's when they will pop in and be like, oh, I want that. But they chit chat for a half hour first, so. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> God. <laughs> okay. All right. We're well, going to Marion. Here I am. You're here, Marion. You could do it. <laughs> okay, let's see. I have some more Hallmark. Since that's what's selling. This is a, uh, what does it say? Snowman. Snowman. Okay. That is a snowman. So we're going to do that. Hallmark. Okay. So I'm oh, going to do two, two, because one's a smaller one. This is. Are, uh, you, are you doing $5 each? No, two for both, five for both of these. Because they're smaller. Oh, okay. Two for five? Yeah. Okay. Over to the left, to the left, to the <laughs> left. No, left. I don't know which is <laughs> opposite direction. <laughs> there we go. There you that go. Perfect. You've got a little elfkin. Look how cute that is. It's ready for a delivery. Yeah. It and a little yeah. tiny snowman. Yep. It doesn't show a year on the front. They're all 2002. They're all 2002. Okay. Show you okay. the back. Where's the back? I think it's down there. Well, 2001, 2002. Yeah. So that is adorable. We have not one, but two 2002. Take it this back. This lady stored her stuff since 2002. Everything in there was 2002. Can you believe it? Lego man, what are you going to stop? You're saying take it back there. What? He's going to stop. Take it back now, y'all. I'm going to stop. Stop what? Stop what? I don't know. We didn't have any guy stuff tonight. I had. I just had the guy's t-shirts. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> hey, the song? What, Snowman? Frosty the Snowman. <laughs> I don't know what song he's talking about. If you don't like these two, how about these two? Oh, wait, unless he's talking about the cha-cha. Oh, okay, he's talking about the cha-cha slide. Okay, okay yes, what? that's what he's talking about. You know, to the left. Now let it slide. Take it back now, y'all. Oh, how cute. Oh, you get all of them. Oh, the sugar plum fairies. That's two adorable. For, these are cute. Two for five. This one. What was the other one? Over oh, to the left. Different. Bring it over. Bring it over. Okay, down a little. Okay. What does this say? What's that say? Oh, Elf? Upside down. Upside down. Can't read it. No. <laughs> Santa's, Santa's toy, toy box. box. Santa has a toy box? <laughs> These two together are five dollars, and then these two together are five dollars. And then I have one more. Whoever buys them can have the, I'll throw this one in. If at Lisa's treasures buy some more, I should throw it in. <laughs> if she's still here. Is she still yeah. there? Nobody is nobody there. Oh yeah. Every time we're like Maybe I should keep them for the next camera. Time, I huh? think she went to bed. <laughs> oh. Might have. How many are there? Well, Brandon's there. Oh, okay. now, now see, he's here. he's, he's talking about the cha cha slide, but yet another song is the uh, jump to the left, step to the right. 
but it's I'll save, I'll save these for the next time. Maybe I'll have some sports cards for Brandon. <laughs> Tamara's making her bed. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, let me save these for next time. You, you can see it. Well, we have Carolina in the house as well. Hello. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's pass and you guys can go. And okay. I have one more. I have this whole rack of jewelry here. Earrings. Stuff. Oh, she's bringing out everything. Bringing out the big stuff. Yeah. This is a dollar start choice. So, so bring it out. You can see the numbers on the thing here. So you got some uh, pretty dangles here. I can get them to stop moving. They're all pierced. You got uh, flowers, flowers here. You got, uh, they're like um, knots, and these are like pearls, and these are silver tone uh, with rhinestones, and then you got the big ones at the bottom here. Let's see what number is this. These, these hang, oops, wrong side, these hang pretty long, they're like a sunflower. Then you got the the pink and kind of like an orangey and then the ruby hot pink balls. Pierced ears. They have the um the hoop earrings and then you got these silver or gold tone um metal earrings. So a dollar start or a dollar dollar choice. Take one, take them all, take your pick. Any interest? These are actually pink here, kind of like washed out. They're pretty. So any interest. Wait, why is the chat so quiet? <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I, I went to sleep for a minute. <laughs> okay. So we've got eight beautiful sets of earrings. You brought out the big stuff. One dollar choice. Or winner can take all. That's right. I like zoned out for a little bit. <laughs> it's bedtime, huh? Bedtime. <laughs> Oh, it's nine o'clock there. It's only seven here. <laughs> oh, well, it's nine here. Well, I don't know. Texas, what do you have? Seven? I, I'm at eight. I'm eight o'clock right now. Oh, eight o'clock. Okay. <laughs> but usually, I'll, I'll be honest, I'm in bed by nine. Wow. Should be in by 8.15. <laughs> I try to be in bed by nine, but then I start staring into space and... Just doesn't work. <laughs> no interest. There's the backs. I think there's no interest. Well, that's okay. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. I'll just put them, put them away. Now you said that's your last one, or you're bringing other stuff out? Uh, no, I'm going to end it with that one. Okay. I uh, think that that works if we're ending it. Yeah. Because okay we're. With uh, me. <laughs> So I hope everybody had fun. And we uh, had fun. Yeah, we all had fun. Lots of laughs. Yeah. yeah I, I bring my little baby back. My oh creepy, boy. My creepy baby. A <laughs> little, little mascot. Well, it's a very quiet mascot for one thing. Well, because he's the sucker. He sucks his thumb. So <laughs> <like that>. oh. <laughs> See? He's a dumb sucker. He's a good baby. <laughs> well, everyone, it has been a pleasure as always. You know we always do this every Friday night where we have way too much fun and probably act like we're totally drunk on alcohol and we didn't even have anything yet. Yeah. I still work on coffee from this morning. <laughs> I had fun, and it's but as always, happy. it's fun, it's and fun. we yeah. we enjoy you supporting us and laughing with us and yeah. having a good time. That's Got right, baby. Yeah. Baby. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm good. gonna get charged with like child abuse because I'm doing things to this baby. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's gonna be like, oh. <laughs> So uh, this is just a quick story. Somebody, I'm uh, locally somebody selling one of the real uh, born babies that looked mm -hmm. so real. I mean, this one you could tell is a doll. It literally looked like a real baby, and he was selling it for uh, six hundred dollars. Everybody started screaming because he thought they were child trafficking his infant. Oh and, like, and I'm like, no, that's that's the price. They were like six hundred dollars. Wow! <laughs> and there was a doll. It was a doll, it was a yeah. doll. but it really, it really looked like it was real, like a real picture and everything. So. Are wow. we still on live chat? We're still live. We're still We're talking. still live. We're, We're still live. We're entertaining we everybody. Haven't, we haven't waved. We haven't waved and said good night okay. to everybody. Oh, okay. <laughs> the whole, the whole two people that's out there are three. Oh, okay. <laughs> you know, we, we love you all. Thank you so much for those of you who did purchase. We will send you out the invoices. And we yep. thank you for being here. Yep. Thanks. Next thank auction you, is you. Tuesday night, seven o'clock. And night. Uh, we'll yeah. have uh, more more people on with more stuff. Right. So yeah. we'll see you then. And hopefully in two weeks or so or next week we'll do our Christmas show. So uh, take care and we'll see you then. Yeah. Okay. See ya. Bye -bye. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.